Yo, what's going on guys? It's Brian, or GamerFever here. Welcome back to another episode of some Minecraft. Now this is a little different. You'll see people are popping here in front of me. Um, we got new people. Uh, this is a public server. Um, we're playing Minecraft Pixelmon on the official Minecraft Pixelmon uh, mod pack that you can get off TechIt. Now this is just one of the servers in the uh, in the list. It's called um, let me let me check the Discord. Uh, Limitless Pixelmon. Um, be sure to check it out uh, on that list if you are interested in playing with me, um, with everyone here on the server. It seems like an interesting server so far. Um, I've taken a little bit of time to learn it, as you can see by my level 23 uh, Charmeleon and my level 25 Ghastly. Um, it just I've been on learning spawn. I've literally not even left spawn, um, which is the case with most of these things. I've just been kind of killing Pokemon. Um, I used some of my starting money to buy some Pokeballs, which is what I used to catch this. I bought some leftovers with the last of my cash. I have exactly zero, so it worked out. And I've been kind of keeping them on this just so we can heal. That's kind of how I leveled them up from, uh, like, level 5. Just put leftovers, killed uh, some, you know, little uh, li little uh, Caterpies around here, right? Um, so when you spawn in, this is where you spawn at. Um, now you got some options of where to go, uh, if we go over here, I believe this is the bank, um, uh, keep in mind that I haven't been doing this all too much, um, and ha it has been a while, aw, oh, um, but yeah, this is the bank where you can deposit and withdraw money, um, now when you die, this has an interesting mechanic of it actually, uh, spawns you back at spawn, you lose some money, and it's kind of like you feel faint and like get knocked out. I think I, I haven't beaten this guy yet. Okay, so we're just going to do a battle. Um, I will probably... I'm out of Dragon Rage. So I will probably lose. Because same level. Uh, and of course he's type effective. Good against me. My Ghastly may be able to do something. But I don't know. I'm trying to just show you guys what happens when you lose. I have no money, so it's not like I can lose money. Um, oh, and my health keeps going up, so I almost took out a slowpoke with the jump. Wait, I'm going to take him out? Oh, I used scratch. Oh, he put me to sleep. What a dick. Maybe I can wake up and... I mean, my health is going up the longer they don't attack me. I'm asleep, so I didn't get paralyzed. Am I going to win? I swear, I, I'm asleep and I may win this because of this this trainer's poor skills. Oh, it nuzzled me and paralyzed me. You dick. I'm just trying to amber him. My health keeps going up. <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, so now we go ghastly. I'm just gonna go the nightshade. Hopefully it'll, uh, it'll be alright. So far so good. It rapid spun me. Yeah, it doesn't affect me. I am ghost. I am immune to your normal type attacks. Nice try though. Uh, I'm now at a nightshade. <laughs> I should have healed. Oh, this is great, guys. <laughs> We're just gonna fucking lick it to death. <laughs> oh my god, please kill. I'm immune to his attack. Oh my lord. I cannot believe this. He literally can't hurt me, and I don't think I have enough moves to damage him. Oh, this is amazing. A crit hit. There we go. Let's go, Ghastly. I'm sure 30... Oh, there he goes. Whatever he hit me with, I'm dead. Okay, so you're out of... All your Pokemon have fainted. So it's going to be... Boom. You feel faint. You respawn here at the Pokemon Center. And your Pokemon are automatically put into this thing. It takes a little second. It's like ding. And you're back out. So this is the, uh, the Pokemon Center that you can heal at. We go up here, we got casual trades and stuff. Um, yeah, there's a, this, this guy seems to be like a main player on the thing. He's got like level 100s, a bunch of paid Pokemon. Because of course, you can always go and donate. We got the uh, computers, of course. This guy just checking your, uh, you can check your IVs. You can check your EVs as well, which is pretty cool. Um, uh, thank goodness they don't seem so this is kind of like it's not focused on pixelmon they have like an arena here uh it's a survival minecraft server which hopes to add in kind of pixelmon so it's still survival minecraft you still do 
Minecraft things. However, you get the added benefit of Pokemon. So it's kind of cool. Kind of been looking for something like this. I've already asked uh, about um, if they got any training centers. They do not. Um, they have no EV training centers. Um, if you, any of you seen my last... Uh, the last time I was actually on a server was um, whenever I was on for uh, Lunar Rising MC. And that was just a kind of a one-off video showing you around uh, Diglett Nation. So that was the last time we were there. That is the shops, of course. You have like these little... I think these are player shops all over the place. Like these are for certain people that are selling things, which is kind of cool. You can buy things off people. You can obviously vote for it. Uh, do what is it? Pixel, pixel points or something, or pixel shop. Uh, what? Do, 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 slash market point shop. There we go. So you can get uh, for 10, you can get 5 rare candies, and you can obviously see what you get down the line for Pokemon Master Rank. That's like a lot of points, because I you can only vote 3 times a day. I voted, so that's, that's quite a bit of points. It's 100 days of voting, so... Hmm. We may have to do that if we uh, if we make it that long. This seems to rain a lot. I'm not gonna lie, and it's very frustrating. That's the bank, and then you got all that stuff. So yeah, we've kind of showed you around spawn a little bit. Um, obviously, you don't want to be spawn forever. This is like the bounty hunters hall, so you can go up to here, and they'll be asking for like specific Pokemon. Uh, this one wants an ordinary size me. I'm or not Mew. Uh, Mew Mew. I don't even know. Um, I'm not, I'm not a Pokemon expert, I pronounce things awfully, we're gonna deal it. Um, now obviously you guys gotta keep in mind that this is a public server, so I have no control over anyone in the chat or anything like that, I don't have any affiliation with the staff or anything. Um, maybe I'll get to know some people the longer I play on here, we'll see how it goes. Maybe I'll get some, uh, good old friends like Austin and Nick on the server. Maybe we'll get some Diglett Nation friends if they're still interested. Who knows? I haven't talked to very many of them in quite a while, but we'll figure that out later. Now, as you can see down at the bottom there, I do have a quest, which is called Village Roots. Find a village to live in. Um, so it's kind of cool. It's kind of like this little you know, quest system in here. So that's really cool. I kind of like that. Um, but yeah, so I, I've been killing... Uh, some Magikarps, kind of farming Magikarps to uh, get some basic fish, just because I don't know what happens when you die. Uh, I don't know if it's gonna like respawn me with all my stuff back at spawn or what. But uh, yeah, so you guys know how this goes by now. It's Pixelmon, um, but I hopefully it'll be more survival like elements with it it'll be a public server so maybe we'll find some really cool dudes is that a drover level 20 i don't know if i can get him but i'm gonna try he's digging a hole oh this is gonna hurt yep that jerk he used mud slap but i'm immune to mu oh yeah i'm immune in ground type moves uh what are the chances he kills me? Okay, he's used to dig. We're gonna Pokeball. <laughs> please. <laughs> oh, please. He, he's dug a hole, but we're gonna throw a Pokeball, which is immune to uh, holes being dug. Hell yeah, we got Drill Bear. Um, Excadrill, I really do enjoy using. Uh, I, you, obviously, the um, Lunar Rising, you didn't get to see much of that, but Excadrill was on one of my main Sandstorm teams when I played. Um, so yeah, hopefully we can, uh, recreate some cool stuff, uh, slash pokey here. Do I have access to that? Nah, of course not. Um, so we're gonna have to go back, and it's a little more of a grind, I will be honest. Um, I'm a little apprehensive about how much of a grind it's gonna take to just, uh, if I wanted to get, like, the right EVs, the right IVs, um, if I wanted to do anything like that, it would be quite a bit of grind just to get to where I need to be. But we'll see how that goes. Um, if it's too grindy, I'll probably have a lot of like off-camera work to do. 
but that really depends. If you guys want to see some of that off camera work, oh, I'm sorry, it is 2:30 a.m. Um, but I wanted to make this video kind of uh, real quick, just why I'm thinking about it, and before I get too far along, that it's like, well, whoops. But um, so I'm gonna go in with Ghastly. This may, this may have been a good move I don't know he keeps using moves that don't affect me normal or ooh licking <laughs> get him out of there zigzagoon is a normal oh it's a normal because of course it is that was dumb of me uh dragon rage zigzagoon he keeps growling at me which is fine uh Oh shoot, Dragon Rage doesn't affect this guy, does it? Uh, Amber? Are we just gonna riddle him down? Ah, Charmeleon, I don't know. I don't know if we can riddle him down. But he keeps mixing in some bad moves, so maybe we can... Maybe we can get lucky. If this was a player, we wouldn't be able to get away with this. Ow. Drillbur. Mud slap him. Whoops. Uh, Metal Claw? Oh, there we go. Metal Claw. That's what I wanted. Metal Claw. Oh, yeah, and I'm ground, so your your electric moves don't affect me. Mud Slap. Let's try Dig. Doesn't affect me. I dug a hole. Doesn't affect me. Boom, bitch. Ooh, Dig. I avoided the attack. Oh, super effective. Dig. Boom, super effective. Can I switch into you and get some XP? Yeah, because you don't affect me right now. Because I'm immune to ground moves and normal moves. And I'm pretty sure it only has ground and normal on this particular one. Ghastly leveled up. He can get payback instead of... Nightshade's Spite. I'm going to get rid of Spite for payback. Ghastly is evolving. Heck yeah, boys. So it should be a Haunter, and because it's level 26, I have to trade it. Ghastly has evolved into Haunter. Yeah, get rid of Lick. Now, this is something really cool that I kind of like. Now, they've there's been too many scams with uh, people doing the like whole trade thing. So I can just do this little command here, trade number two. Haunter is now evolving without having to actually do trades. Simply because if we had to do it with players, player would like scam away someone's like really good Pokemon. And it's kind of nice that I can do that. And now we have ourselves a level 26 Gengar. You gotta love the boy Gengar. And this is a very strange stream, Charmeleon, Gengar, and Drillbur. Um, I don't remember what level Drillver turns into Excadrill. Uh, uh, Drillver. Level 31, actually. Exc I could be about on my way to an Excadrill, actually. That's pretty nice. So, how much XP are you at? Oh yeah, you're pretty much almost there. Okay, well, then our goal is to try to upgrade Drillbur into Excadrill. We have a Gengar, and we'll get our Charmeleon as, uh, our Charmeleon will work on maybe between episodes, maybe next episode. Um, we'll see how it goes. Uh, but I'm gonna try not to make these episodes insane, like... Dig. Can't hit me. Boom. <laughs> Dig's so annoying. Um, but, uh, but yeah. So we'll try not to do anything crazy. Um, ooh, welcome to the dude who just made their first achievement. We're gonna dig. Can't hit me. Boom. Take the gunpowder. How much XP is this getting? It's getting there. Um, we need higher levels. We may be able to hurt this Geodude. Used rollout. Can't get... Oh. 
Oh. Oh. Wait, what did I use? Mud support? It didn't do damage. That was dumb. Um that's better. Inventory management, we're always bad at that. Uh we're kinda traveling a little way from spawn. Um we're gonna do some RTPs, so we don't have to worry too much about um Ooh. Metal Claw? Uh oh. You are a jerk. It just keeps defensive curling. We're gonna have to keep digging because it's our most damaging move, apparently. Um, okay, so someone chose Torchic. Now Torchic is one of my favorite starters to to be fair, like I just really like using Torchic. Um, ooh, there we go. Uh, I can't see a thing, so this is fine. Um, as I was saying, I really like using Torchic, but I want to just start with Charmander because you know Charmander is the OG, and in Pixelmon specifically, you can upgrade him real quick into uh, Charmander, level 36, and have a flying Pokemon to fly around the map on. Uh, horn Drill stabs a target with a horn that rotates like a drill. Target stays. So if this hits, he fades instantly. Dig. Metal Claw, Mud Slap, or Mud Sport. Uh, mud Sport doesn't really matter to us. So we're going to get rid of that. And now we have an Excadrill. Um, we now have an Excadrill, Gengar, and Charmin. Charmin. Now, I'm not sure what kind of party we're going to be going for. So far we have... Fire, ground, slash steel, and ghost slash poison. So we do, oh, see, people are donating and they get random shiny Pokemons. Um, so yeah, you can donate. Um, I doubt we'll spend money on this server ever. I never, I try to make it a policy to not spend money on things like mobile games, um, servers, and things like that. I don't always listen to myself. I have bought some things on a mobile game before. I bought some stuff for servers. Um, but I try not to make it a habit of just like, oh, I've played this for like five minutes, we're gonna spend money on it. I have to really become dedicated and think, you know what, this is a great server, really enjoying it. Um, and I think this will be around for quite a while, which Lunar Rising MC actually was uh, my main Pixelmon server uh, and po uh, Minecraft server in general for the longest time. Um, it had obviously Diglett Nation, I think I had probably six months to what was it it was like six to eight months or so on that server of just straight every day we play a game so it it was pretty pretty legit we had pretty high standards for what we did we built mega trump wall um i don't know if that's allowed in the youtube video but oh well um but yeah we we did some crazy stuff and it's a real shame the server no longer exists. It's uh, sometime apparently it was taken down or it just couldn't be upkept for a while. Um, they have said that it will be back someday and I haven't played or talked to anyone from it for a long time myself. So it's not that bad, but it is a shame. I did, I did really love playing the server. Um, but, uh, yeah, so we're just kind of traveling around. We're still within range of spawn, just seeing what we can find here. I haven't seen any Pokemon that really catch my eye. If any of you know me at all on any of my um, Pokemon stuff I've done before, uh, I love a Cloyster. I need to find me a Cloyster just because, or a Sheldor, I guess, would be the the young one, but I need to get it a Cloyster because I freaking love Cloyster. Is that... That's either player made stuff or a village. Now we have a quest to find a village, so maybe this will do something for us. We'll find out before heading back to spawn. Now I want to try to keep these episodes, like I said, around 20 to 30 minutes. It looks like it's player made stuff. Um, so I don't think this will count for my find a village thing, even if they are in themselves a village, maybe. We'll do that, get 
some F cards. Now, if their land is claimed, I don't know if I can, like, can I? Yeah, I do not have permission to build here. Ooh, somebody's been... Somebody has been busy. There's a plumbing. I don't think that's how that's pronounced, but oh well. Yeah, we got to... Uh, you turn into a beedrill later. Oh. You want some? He wants it. Oh, his scratch hurts. Come on. Charmeleon. Boom. Alright, well, he dropped a fish. I'll take it. Um... I kind of want to catch that guy. Where did he go? Level 10. Can I scratch him without killing him? Okay, I can. Bag, Pokeballs. So no one poke you, Pokeball at him. We should catch him. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe he's going to be a dick. And use more than one Pokeball on himself. That's cool. That's cool. I understand your motive. Now, listen, sir. Sir. I don't want to have... If I have to use another Pokeball, I'm just going to kill him. Don't make me kill you. Alright, he understood. So, we have a pretty big village here. You can obviously tell players will be on here a lot. I don't know if there's a world border, but my general policy upon joining any public servers is travel the farthest you can possibly travel from the edge to the edge of the world, and that's usually what I do. Now, you are a bug and poison. Bug and poison. So our team is, if I catch a, it'll be heavy poison. Do I, do I mind a heavy poison build right now, though? Maybe able to cheese some stuff. I do like fungo. Let's see if we can burn him. Okay, we did burn him. Ow, he's gonna be a dick. We can burn him one more time and it should get him to red hell. Now we have to do this soon. Through the Pokeball. I wanted to use an Ultra, but I didn't know if it would be worth it. Now, if he gets too low... Okay, we got him. Alright, let's check out our new guy. It's Grass Poison, so... We do have three Poison on our team. Contact may cause Poison, it's Paralysis, or Sleep. I do like that ability when I'm just messing around in the wild. Absorb, Mega Drain, Ingrain, Abide. They're not the greatest moves. Ooh! He's up speed. It's not always what you want. Some Pokemon don't need it, or in some cases don't want it. But it couldn't hurt. Special defense is a little down. It's not a big deal. Ooh, an Abra. Oh. What level is it? 16. I think... I can burn it. He teleported away. God damn it. Maybe I'll try this guy. I want one of these. I definitely want. Oh, you bitch. I want an Ab Abra. God damn it. Where is it? It's in the fucking trees. Bitch. Oh. Sir? Sir, can you come out of the damn tree? I, I can't even right now. Sir, get out the damn tree. Sir? Sir? We need one more Pokemon for our immediate party. Um, just so that this episode's complete with... Oh, I'm not even allowed to break shit. Uh, that makes this a little more tricky. Ow. 
I'm out of food. Yeah, not getting a hooter. Food is going to be a problem. Can I please hit this guy? What if I... No, okay. It doesn't seem like I'm going to be able to get that ABBA. Teddy Ursuring gets the turns into that teddy bear. Spinner axe, my bug. I want a water Pokemon, so I should be heading toward the coast to be fair. I want Cloister. Hmm. Which, to be fair, clo the Cloister build I usually use is I have no idea what that is I want to see a Swalot I have no fucking clue what this Pokemon is and I kind of want to catch it because of that um Cloister build I use anyway what I was saying is mostly for ice to be fair Ooh. this is another poison yeah it's another poison why are we uh, uh, shouldn't go so heavy poison. Uh, as, as funny as it would be. <laughs> um, another poison! Whoa, 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 whoa. Sir? Dragon Rage should take care of you in two hits. Ow! Bruh! Go away! Ooh, a poison gem, though. Slash I IVs 2. What's his IVs? In? Speed, weirdly enough. So those little gems disappear whenever you, uh, whenever you see their IVs. So if you want to see the IVs of a particular Pokemon, you need to have the corresponding gem. So like if I wanted to get my Charmeleon on this server and see what his IVs are, I would need a fire gem. It's an interesting concept. Like it gives you something to use with all these crappy little gems that no one ever uses anything for. I am out of food and probably not the greatest position. I need a water Pokemon. That is definitely not a water Pokemon. I'm in a swamp. Is there like a warp ocean? Let's go back to spawn. Um, I don't have a water Pokemon right now. That is my goal. It's like Let's see, uh, J, there we go. So it does kind of, ha it's, a, it's a swamp, not an ocean, which is kind of not what I want. <laughs> Damn. Oh well. Um, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. It's been about 30 minutes. Uh, as far as the first episode goes, it's not bad. We almost got a complete party. Uh, the only one that I'm missing on my list of people I want right now is some type of water Pokemon, preferably a Cloyster, um, which I will have to find, do a little digging, searching, and anything of that sort. Anyway, if you like this video, leave a like, comment down below, and of course, subscribe if you're new. Uh, I love seeing all the comments and stuff. Anyway, guys, I will see you guys all later. Goodbye.